All right, welcome back to the Knives Fast channel, guys. Say hello to Ren and Stimpy and Patter Tisman, Log TV and Choo Choo, and let's get started with today's video. All right, time for some Knives Fast double unboxing surprise. By the way, Knives Fast, check it out. Hit that subscribe notification bell and check us out on Instagram, or me, I should say. Let's get into this first package, and let's see, who does this come from? It comes... Uh, from Goondocks. Guys, if you're not uh, following his channel, definitely go check him out. Goondocks. Uh, very cool. And I cannot remember what knife this is or from which pass around group it is from, uh, but we will find out together momentarily. I keep trying not to show addresses, so if you see me go off camera, that is why. Um, yes, I'm a complete goober, uh, and that is all good. All right, let's see what we've got. I cannot remember. We have got a knife. No way. All right. So it looks like uh, one knife, and this is an exciting one. I believe this is from the Apex Pass Around Group. And you guys know I have had Sharif Manganis. I said his name right. Sharif, I said your name right. Um, on my live stream twice. And uh, guys, you can tell right away this is produced by Kaiser because of this style of box. And there is our Goondock stickers. We'll put uh, these in our, uh, well, well, we'll keep one and pass the other one on to the next guy, but we'll put that on in our next, um, uh, knives, uh, KF live unboxing. Holy cow. And Sharif has gone crazy with the stickers inside this, uh, sticker. So you've got information about Mangana steel there. You can freeze that and check it out. And you've got uh, guitar pick shape, uh, stickers here, which are super awesome. Kind of a, Egyptian flair going on. You've got what looks like, oh, the, the cards are the same. Yeah, so that's very cool. So we'll leave a, the one of those out and one of those out, and we will look at the knife because that's what you guys came here for. Now, we're going to do two unboxings. This is the first one. All right, so this is the Manganus, Manganus Steel. See, I still screwed it up. Uh, Kaimano. All right, so we have a hole. Oh, yeah. Um, and who that detent and we have a flipper. Hold on guys. Ooh, uh, yes. Very nice. You have, uh, you know, kind of, uh, well, let's see. Are we, no, we are flat, uh, with chamfers here. I believe, I don't think it is contoured. If it is, it is very slight. You've got beautiful gray, uh, titanium here with the overlays of uh, this micarta. I think there's also a purple fat carbon version. And then this blade, guys. I mean, this is very Sharif looking. Uh, you have a great thumb ramp with jimping here, and you have a spot to land out here with a uh, kind of harpoon. You have a deep hollow ground. Woo, very deep hollow ground with satin finish. Uh, main grind here, and then a flat... Uh, to make that tip a little more, uh, you know, robust, if you will. Guys, this thing is super cool. Uh, not, you know, you guys have heard me before, not my first choice for a blade shape, but I cannot wait to cut with this and see what I think. Now, you do have uh, the Sharif Manganis, the Manganis Steel uh, logo there, and you have no other... Uh, Wow, no other uh, billboarding at all. Very nice. This thing is gorgeous, and I really like the action on the drop. Look at that. Fantastic. Titanium backspacer. N reversible clip. Very nice. Just a gorgeous knife. Sharif, you killed it, man. So we'll do a full review on this, guys. This is not a full review. This is an unboxing. Um... And, you know, sometimes my unboxings are unhinged, and sometimes they're okay. Uh, when I did my D Devo Nip unboxing, it was not my best work. But hopefully you guys uh, enjoyed that anyway. Uh, five hours of sleep and working 15 hours the day before is not a great um, uh, formula to do an unboxing. But uh, there you go. All right, so the next one, let's just move. Tell you what, let's move some of this. We're just going to move it over here. We're going to put this box. This box right here comes from Alex Billingsley. Alex is from 814 EDC. I'm cutting it off camera 
because again, labels all over. Used uh, my microburst this time around because that's what I grabbed. Love my microburst. Oh, I cut the wrong place. Um, so we're going to do this and open this guy up. I have no idea. I kind of have a hunch of what knife this is, and it is. All right, so here is a knife. And uh, Alex put an 814 sticker in here and a Hello Sunshine sticker and... Uh, a Hello Sunshine. I don't know what Hello Sunshine is, Alex. What? What? I mean, we got a smiley face and some candy and what in the world? A, a smiley stress ball and a bunch of uh, yellow uh, stuff here. So very nice, Alex. What is happening, man? Uh, so we're gonna move all this stuff off. What is? What is that? Hold on. Oh, so is this? No, that is uh, lemonade. Okay. Uh, well, I would tell you guys what Hello Sunshine is, but I don't know. Uh, so you can you can tell me. So there's your 814 sticker. Check him out, 814 EDC. I think he just, yeah, he did just go over 1,000 subs recently. This is a Oaks Works Lantra EDX. Now, guys, I have wanted to get my hand on this, hands on this one for a long time, and unfortunately, I think these may be out of stock at this point, but I wanted to look at it anyway. Machine Satin High Flat Grind M390 Purple Haze Fat Carbon uh, Titanium Frame Lock Titanium Screws and Clip and Back Spacer Milled Bolster Bolster Screws and Spacer Anodized and this is of course uh, from Eric Oaks of Oaks Works Big Cloth in here as well very nice uh, so let's see this beautiful knife and I'm gonna do a review on it anyway. Uh, even if it's not in stock, you guys might be able to find them on the secondary. So I'm going to do a review. Let me know what you guys think of that uh, when I do that. I mean, often it's tough uh, to, to do a review in a timely fashion when it's in a, a pass around. This one has been floating around for three or four, maybe five months. Um, and I finally got my hands on it. But, you know, it is what it is. Um, you got purple fat carbon here. You got a gorgeous knife, this knurling is ridiculous purple uh pivot good looking single screw pocket clip that doesn't it moves a little bit but not much uh doesn't look to be reversible uh you have a front flipper and a thumb stud and of course we're going to hit the stud first nice very nice looking drop point blade guys this is kind of my favorite kind of small knife it's a small knife but it is a four finger small knife and you got a little room to choke up and so for me this is pretty cool uh beautiful blade you have purple on that uh, thumb stud as well and you have a front flipper it is a frame lock uh eric does a lot of those and does them whoops does them well the detent's pretty good yeah the thumb stud is down really low uh i'm used to a thumb stud being right about here uh so it's that's what you're seeing there with me not getting it, let's see. Oh, yeah, I can middle finger flick the heck out of it. Um, and so really nice. I think I would just middle finger flick it every time. Uh, very nice. And is this... Man, I don't know. I'm going to have to look it up. I think it's flat. If it's hollow, it's not a, not a super drastic hollow. Uh, but I think it's flat. But... And you guys are probably yelling at me already. Uh, some of you have them and you're like, hey, it's hollow or whatever. Um, so really beautiful. So let's look at both of these knives we have here. We've got the Oaks Works L, uh, what is it called? The Oaks Works L something something. L EDX, not LDX. Uh, and you have the beautiful uh, Mangana Steel or MS Steel uh beautiful kaimano uh these are available on pre-order as we speak guys the kaimano so definitely go check that out on his website again i had that card up here for a minute it is uh m uh, well he doesn't have his website but i believe it's ms-steel.com i believe that's what it is um so go definitely check out uh sharif's pre-order and again if if i can find a link to this one I will leave it, okay? If I find a link, that's what you're going to get. So, again, very nicely done. Beautiful stuff. Thank you, Alex. 
And uh, thanks to Goondocks uh, for sending this stuff along. So we're going to wrap this up. Thank you for checking out these two. Wait for my review coming soon. Give me a thumbs up. Comment down below. Guys, I appreciate each and every one of you. And thank you so much for watching the Knives Fast channel.